In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to make a cutscene in Roblox Studio. So the first thing you need to do is install this plugin here called Cutscene Plugin. The way you can do that is you can go to Manage Plugins um, here, and then you should be able to search for the plugin you want. Uh, click Add, and then type it in. So this one's called, you can just type in Cutscenes or cutscene and this one's one of the first ones that comes up it's called codes otaku cutscene it's a very good one it's the best one and it's free so from here let's put in a object oh, I keep pressing that let's put in a structure let's put in a classic house here oops okay nice So from here, let's let's create a cutscene with this. So I think this is over the player start. Yeah, there we go. There we go. So we can create the cutscene now. The way we do it is we click on here, go to create cutscene, and we need to have a name of this. So we'll say intro. If it's an intro cutscene, we can click create. Here we go. Now what we want to do is set duration down to zero, type down to linear. There we go. These look the best settings. And what we can do here is we can start, where's the first place do you want the cutscene? Let's say the first place we want the cutscene is here. We can hit the space bar and it's going to create a camera there. Now we need to go to the next place we want the cut, next place we want the camera to go. Say we want it to go there, we need to change how long we want the duration to be of that. So I'm going to put four seconds. I'm going to hit another one here, actually might have to do inside. Hit another one here. That's going to go through the building and go there. And then I could set a, like another cutscene like over here if I wanted to. Now I'm going to click generate script here. And this is um, the, cut is cut the cut screen is going to be when the player joins. Now there's other settings that you can do like when it touches an item or stuff like that. But this is just how you do that. So now if I start the game, you'll see that it should start it straight away. You can see that the cutscene here is done exactly how I've how I've made it do it. And now we can start playing. And that's how you do it. Now there's a lot of settings you can obviously change in this if you want to make the um if you want the cutscene to happen when you do something, whatever you need, you can change that. Now if you have any questions about this and how to edit it or whatever, then please leave them down below and I'll answer those for you. And if you have any other questions about other topics, then please let me know and I'll answer those as well. So thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe and comment down below that it helped. Thank you.